from one Blue Jays way in Toronto. Welcome to Rogers Center. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Cincinnati Reds and the Toronto Blue Jays. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Steve Rogers digs in now. He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. No score just getting started top of the first. Out to center. Maciel moving under this one. Makes the grab and that's the inning. Reds down. And now for the Jays, Kevin Varela. I mean, these guys know they have to get going out of the gates, but you're not going to hear a skipper. You're not going to hear people really say that. Up the middle, Rogers picks it up in plenty of time to first, and there are two outs. No, he didn't recognize changeup earlier enough, got out in front a little bit, rolled over on it, and beat it into the ground. Back to the leadoff spot in the Blue Jays lineup. Now here's the leadoff the man for the Blue Jays, Tim Tanner. Tim Tanner. On the ground to the left. Sends it to Tolia, and that is that. On to inning number four. It's the Blue Jays one, and the Reds nothing. Back here at Rogers Center as we go to the top of the fourth and ready to hit now for Cincinnati, Steve Rogers. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He's the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game. That one ripped. And it is gone. With one swing, he quiets the crowd. His 16th homer of the year, it's tied at one. Well, he went up there, oh, oh, looking to do damage. I think he had his sight set on that pitch. He went and got it. Next for Cincinnati, Steve Rogers. He's already homered in this game. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. And a foul ball. Hey, let's go, big fella. One down, base is empty. That smash towards center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's two down. Man, that's one of those at bat. Base is empty, one away. Stepping in, the long ball threat, Steve Rogers. This guy with big time power and an elite defender. Swung out, belted. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. A solo shot is 17th of the year, and they're chipping away. It's 7-6. For a pitcher, the odds are in your favor if you keep that breaking ball down. That time, he got punished for it. Hitter just did a really good job of staying within himself and getting the barrel to the baseball. Welcome back. Bottom of the inning. Now the left fielder, Mario Lima. For the Jays, the left fielder, Mario Lima on the ground to short Rogers handles the chance and one away in the bottom of the seventh the third baseman number 24 Kevin Varela Steve Rogers the next to hit if you don't get ahead in the count 
you can forget about having any success against him. Roger. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. On the ground, right side. Two down. Got it. Now batter, the third baseman. One down, runner at third. Rafael Marchand next up for the Blue Jays. Out to short. Oh, great grab on the dive. And he'll just eat it. That's an infield single. No, that at bat had a lot riding on it, sir. Man in scoring position with two away. Stepping in, Steve Rogers. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. He gets the intentional walk here and now a force at any base with two gone. Clearly didn't want to mess with them right there. So I think it makes sense to play now the numbers game in this spot. Nolan. Now here's Nolan Jones. It's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. And a count one and two. First and second, two down. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Last shot here as we go to the bottom of the 11th. It's the Reds 9 and the Blue Jays 8. Well, I love the fact they didn't quit. They had to do a little extra work tonight to secure this win, but it's what you got to do over the course of a season if you want to be a championship ball club. And the final here today, 9-8. A one-run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Chomby saying 